I am up. It's about 9.30 in the morning. I had a horrible, horrible night. That's why I look like I'm in shambles here right now. I was so tired and I wanted to go to sleep so bad. But my restless legs was not having any part of it. Nope. No sleep for you, they said. So I did everything I normally do that helps me to calm them down so I can go to sleep. I drank my hot chocolate. I took extra medication. I took a nice hot shower. And I hate hot showers. And it just wasn't stopping. So I came out here and did some packing away of our Halloween village. Um, this way I wasn't in there. My legs were keeping Kevin awake. So I packed away the village, but I couldn't find two boxes, so I kind of stopped with that. And I didn't go to bed till almost 6 o'clock this morning, and I'm up now. It's 9.30. I really just want to go back to sleep. But I want to get my house done because I want to go see Nikki and John and Iris this weekend. So I have to do some stuff around the house so I can do that. But right now, I'm going to make myself some breakfast and eat that and watch a little bit of TV while I'm eating. And then, time to work. Hey, everybody, I'm back. I had my breakfast and I kind of fell back to sleep for a little while. I was really tired. I didn't get much sleep last night because of the restless legs. But Kevin looked up some information about it, so we have some things we have to try. So, I am going to get started on putting away Halloween and cleaning up my house and making it look like my house again. So, Hello everybody, just got home from work and found my wife pretty much crashed out and sore and in pain and uh, she did a lot of work around the house, which she probably shouldn't have done. I had to do some, but I probably did more than I should have. And Boomer, you weren't watching. You're supposed to keep her, keep her off her feet. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. So let's go take a look at to see what you did. I'm not coming with you because I'm not getting out of bed. Did you bleed on anything? Did you manage to not fall down? I, <laughs> I actually. I did fall down, but I was standing on the table at the edge of the couch, and when I fell down, I fell down on the couch. So, I'm glad the couch was there. So, you didn't hurt yourself. I didn't hurt myself. So I fell at, down on the couch. So, you're at two days right now. Yep. And then, I had you just check for a scratch or a cut on my arm because while I was in the garage trying to find something I scraped my arm up against the door of the garage mm -hmm. and I wasn't sure if I cut myself or not and when I was bending down or squatting down to put some stuff in the bottom cabinets in the kitchen. I kind of was stretching my foot and I'm not supposed to put stretch the bottom of my foot. Uh -huh. So I kind of went down quick on my ankles and I kind of hurt my left ankle. So... I hurt that so you're still not saying that you hurt yourself? Um, nothing that I think should be set me back to zero because, I mean, yeah, I'm sore and achy and tired, and but it's all, I think, just from overdoing what, everything that I did today. But, I mean, show them what I did in the living room and in the kitchen and and I put some of the stuff in the dining room back to where it belongs and I packaged up a lot of the Halloween stuff but not everything because 
I couldn't find boxes for stuff. But you said we didn't keep boxes, so. So here's the kitchen. She did a pretty good job of cleaning this up. The dishes are all done. Things are all put away. Uh, we have a box still out that's for uh, our cat who seems to love boxes. So we'll leave that out for him for a little while. I have to put the table back together. Uh, Val couldn't do that, it's too heavy. Val says, creepy doll is going to stay out. So we're going to have to find some place to put her. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so she's done a pretty good job in the back room here. Everything looks nice and clean. The floor could use the vacuuming. Yes, Bones is naked. We're uh, in between outfits. I think our next outfit should be uh, probably uh, Veterans Day. I'm not quite sure what we're going to put him in for that. Um, bar's all nice and cleaned up. We've got the only place where we still have uh, webs is going to be in uh, Bar Fly Bobs. I think that's going to stay. And I'll put the uh, cabinets back into the dining room. I still need to put uh, the table back together. And she started packing away all of our Halloween stuff, which is going to go up into our crawl space. Hopefully this weekend, when I have the time. And uh, she did a lot of work for uh, for one day, for someone who could barely walk. So, pretty, pretty happy she did what she did, but uh, she probably shouldn't have done it. How you doing there, buddy? Bless you. Can you roll over? Roll over! Roll over! Okay, play dead! <laughs> Good. Oh, are you going to roll over? Oh, come on, you can do it! You can do it! Here, let me help you. Oh, playing dead again. Alright. <sighs> and there's the boots. Doing okay. Doing okay. There's the wife, not doing so good. <laughs> but I didn't put all the chotskis and decorations and stuff back out completely yet because I'm going to kind of change things up a little bit. Um, the plants from there, that plant, and the plants on that dresser, and the plants from the bathroom will go back into the front living room. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to change up the whole shelf unit in the bathroom there. I'm going to leave the creepy cloth and the bells that are on there on that. And I'm going to change the decorations in the bathroom a little bit. But I'm not going to do anything else tonight except Sleep. wait. Well, wait patiently for my ice packs and probably take some medications and go to sleep. Okay. Cause I, Who's going to do that for you? You. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Hey, everybody. Guess what time it is. It's howdy doody time. It's howdy doody time. Da 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 da. <laughs> okay, everybody. I need some more prayers to go out. Janet Johnson, one of our neighborhood community members, is having some medical issues still, and she needs our prayers. So if everybody can please keep her in your thoughts and prayers, we would greatly appreciate that. And Lucy Owlbones, I know your husband is naked and we need to get him dressed as soon as possible. Thanksgiving is coming up, so he's going to be wearing his pilgrim outfit. Mm. Yes? Yeah. Yes. Crimson Fairy. No, I will not try one of your cakes as long as I know <laughs> what you do to them at Halloween time. And no one slept on the couch. We just built a bigger barrier. <laughs> Mm. 
And then he pushes everything on top of me. That's what so, so making the barrier. I get this little itty bitty. We have a you king plenty, size bed. You have plenty of room. You just want to stick your butt off the end. That's all. Yeah, but every time I roll over, where are you going? Every time I roll over, I'm hit in the face with the tissue box, with the the wicker basket that holds the remotes and his junk food. Yeah, I, I would like a little bit more room than that. You got tons of room over there. I don't. You do. I don't. You do. Don't. Don't. No. Don't. So I woke him up in the middle of the night last night, and he's like, I was sleeping. I don't care. I can't sleep. And I couldn't sleep. So. Shelter from Wind asked if we are still taking ghost stories. From our subscribers and yes we don't want to do ghost stories just at Halloween we'll do ghost stories all year round so keep those ghost stories coming guys it's and always we'll, Halloween here yeah and we'll get some of those ghost stories together and we will sit down and tell some more and okay I know for a fact we for a fact, for a fact, a fact. we know don't we we have a lot of gamers that follow us. Yes, we do. And Rex25059 needs subscribers so he can catch up with his <laughs> sister, Katie Caroline. Who's at, what, 200 Katie, subscribers now? Katie is at 200 or, or more, 200 plus subscribers. And Rex, I think, only has like 21. No. Yeah. So, we need to get Rex some subscribers. So, all of you gamers, we need to hook you all up together and start a whole big gaming group. So, go subscribe to Rex25059. And even if you're not a gamer, he does do other little films on his channels, too. So, go subscribe to Rex25059. He needs our help. And I didn't write it down, but Daryl Roper said that he knew right from the beginning that we were genuine people, that we were ourselves. <laughs> and he, he said that because I said that Yes, I am nuts that my mother had me tested and that I take meds for that for their safety. For my safety. <laughs> and he said most people wouldn't admit to that. But you know what? I never try to be anything that I'm not. Except the polar bear. Yeah, except the polar bear. I love trying to be... And cats. I love trying to be called polar bears and cats. So, but I never try to be anything that I'm not. And if people don't like who I am or the way I act. They don't have to watch. But we have some, we have 2,308 subscribers right now. Mm -hmm. Yay! So. Groovy man. Groovy man. It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll! Are you getting tired of that? Go ahead, do your thing. Do my thing. Do your thing. Okay. I get settled. That's not your thing. Okay. See, see, Christopher, I'm still wearing my crossbows. Hey, stop pulling on my polar bear arms. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We would not be here if it weren't for you all. We love you. Thank you. Thumbs up. And we will see you all tomorrow.